two is nearly finished of homeschooling um, and today I'm going to show you some phonics activities that Gabriel's going to be doing and then we're going to look at some comic strip writing uh, oh, that doing. Noah's doing, yeah. So shall we have a look at what you're doing Gabriel? <laughs> so these are just some things that I've got from around the house and I've written on some pieces of paper some letters. Gabriel, what? what's that? Say it again. B. Goodbye. C -c Goodbye. And what's this one? D. Goodbye. Now then, Gabriel, we are going to sort these objects. Okay? And we're going to put them with the right sound, the initial sound. So, do you want to choose one? Yeah. Choose one of them. Which one are you going to choose? Choose one of the objects, one of the toys. I knew you were going to go for that one. That's your favourite, isn't it? Yeah. What have you got there? That. Cat. So, what sound does that start with? D. Cat. D. Listen, cat. What does it start with? Does it start with B, C or D? Cat. D. Listen, One. Well, we've got B, K, and D. Good boy. <laughs> Put it on that one then. Put it on the yellow piece of paper. Well done. Right. Can, can you? I'll lay it down this time? You can lay it down. That's fine. Which one do you want to pick next? Uh, okay. What's that? Easter. It is a police car, but for today we're just going to call it a car. Car. Which sound does that start with? Uh, Listen, k ah. Good boy. Put it with that one. Pick another. Uh, what? Dragon. Listen, dragon. Dragon. Duh. Duh. Good boy. <laughs> I didn't do duh. That's I wanted to do duh. Pick another. Cow. K ow. K k ow. Goodbye. <laughs> I don't really do that doing this thing. You are. What else can you see? Bed. Bed. B ed. B ed. Did you dot it out one my word? I did. Listen. One my last. Song. Listen. B ed. Goodbye. <laughs> What else have we got? Um, What's that? Nana. <laughs> we do call it a nana. It's actually a banana. Didn't think when I picked that up. <laughs> banana. Banana. Goodbye. What else? Batman. Batman. Where's he gonna go? Listen. Listen. Batman. B Good. Down, what else that. have we got? The book. Where's that going to go? This one. Listen to it. Say the word again. You say the word. Uh, what is it that you've got? Book. Book. Which is that one going to go on? Book. 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 I found it anywhere. I'll just put it in front. That's fine. As long as it's with the other ones yeah as long as it's with the right ones mom we've got three things left brick brick B brick good uh, i thought that one was the right one you were just putting it on the right one then what else have we got ER. what is er what what is he is he a cat no what is he a donkey. Good. Donkey. Where's that going to go? This one. Good. Good it all there. Yeah. And what have you got left? Dinosaur. Dinosaur. Where's that going to go? It lost, it lost dinosaurs to here. Good time. boy. Give me a high five. 
Well done. That's you who've done your activity now. Let me do it on my own. Of course you can. Yeah. And what else you could do, Gabriel? What? You could try and find some other things that could go on those with those sounds as well. So this is a really um, quick and easy activity. It's just using things around the house and some bits of paper with some letters written on it. It doesn't take much preparation at all. Um, the problem I had last night was I wrote the letters first and then struggled to find things that began with that letter. So maybe look around for things first. It makes it easier. Um, we're going to have a look at what Noah's doing um, now. Um, I do work as well as homeschooling and it's hard to fit everything in. Um, they do watch a film every day when I work um, and I'm trying to make that beneficial to both of us. It helps me out because I can work but I'm trying to make some use of that in learning as well. So I'm just going to show you what we're doing. So Noah is currently doing some writing. We'll have a little look at what you're doing in a minute, okay? So we've got here some DVDs and the books that go with them. So to try and make the most out of that, you're making funny noises this morning, <laughs> to try and make the most out of that, Noah, yesterday, what film did you watch? Um, I watched Incredibles and I watched Chicken Little. Yeah, you managed to get two in yesterday, didn't you, as I was working? <laughs> so today, to make the most of that, Noah is doing a comic strip can I just have a look at what you've done so far on The Incredibles? So, if we have a look, he's written in the bottom. I've just split some boxes up and he's written the story so far. Now, to help him with this, I didn't just get him to go and do it straight away. We discussed together the story, didn't we, Noah? Mm -hmm. And on a whiteboard together, we wrote down... The six key points, he's already done the first three, that's why he's rubbed them off. We wrote down the six key points together that happened in the story. And then he's drawing pictures to go with them. And afterwards, I th do you think, I think I know someone who'd love you to read this to them. Gabriel. Yeah, your little brother would love you to read this story, wouldn't he? Yeah. Yeah? So you're going to carry on with your pictures, that's super. Can you read to us what you've put so far? What Mr. We've got. Incredible Marries Elastigirl Superheroes are not allowed in the city anymore. Mr. Incredible gets another superhero job. Good, and then what did we say happens next? Can you read the last Mr. Three? Incredible gets tricked by his old fan buddy who now called Syndrome. Good. Elastigirl and Dash and Violet come to help, come to the rescue. The Incredibles have now saved the world. Good, so we've split that story down. We've got the key points. We had to discuss it because Noah wanted to put a lot more detail in us. So we can only do six. So we really had to focus on the story. And this helps with story planning and breaking them down and thinking about the real key things that happens. That's our learning for today. We're gonna to say bye, Noah. Bye-bye. Oh, I hope you have a lovely weekend and we'll see you next week. Gabriel, do you want to come in and run in and say bye? I think he's still there. Bye-bye. Oh. Bye. 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 We'll see you soon.